chapter 
view from it. So, let's ground this energy down and open you up to just get some more awareness of what actually happened. What is this for you? Sometimes it's words, language, feelings, sensations, memories, visions, understandings, callings. It comes, you know, across in different ways, but let's just open this. Open this, open this, open this up for you, okay? Open this, open this, open this, open this up. Open this, open this, open this, open this, open this up. Open this up for you, okay? So I'm going to take little pieces and open this energy up for you, okay? And expand you in the direction to see things clearly. So sometimes it feels like a hovering above the body or it feels like a, you know, you become very far away, but yet it's more of like an objective view of being able to see yourself in your life without you being in the middle. Because when you're in the forest, you can't see the trees. So just pulling this perspective back. And I want you to see how much you have grown. I mean, in exponentially beautiful ways. See everything that you have accomplished up until this moment. See what you built. See where you're going. See what you've experienced, what conclusions you have come to. you're 
you can When you take care of yourself, you can 
healing journey. So yes, you may be doing something really nice and sweet, or that might be your goal, but if you just solve your internal life goals, you'll be able to naturally help others seamlessly. You won't have to go outside your way. You also won't have to do things for show. It won't have to be a big public display of, oh, look at me doing this great thing. No, you'll do things in your everyday life in a very seamless way and without the need of something in return. And when you don't take care of yourself and you want to take care of other people and you don't, you know, fill yourself up, you will grow bitter of pouring yourself into people and getting nothing in return. Take care of yourself so that when you give